Hey guys, <clears throat> we've probably been at the same boat ramp before on a different video, and that one over the winch in the boat, the ATV winch. This is a little bit heavier duty off-road winch that we offer. Um, it's about a 9,000 pounder, so it'll rip just about anything up or down, uh, including our jet boats and stuff. But I just want to go over it, just you know, show you in operation. This is a uh, our uh, my trailer lights don't work on my truck, so this is our upgraded trailer. You can see that it's got you know cool metal fenders, fancy rims, stealth craft logos everywhere, and this is a tilt trailer, which is cool for boat ramps like this. And you just pull the pin, and this comes out, and it's got a. Now we attach them because people are losing them. And then this, you can see we have our big heavy duty winch up here. And we also have our backup. This is our green cottage winch, just in case this happens to not work. I'm gonna back her off a little bit. And there's just enough room that you can get by with your hand. Nice safety chain here. We don't do any outtakes here either, so. Oh, I gotta take my G2 belt buckles off. Hold on. Keep on outtakes. I don't know why I wasn't moving. There, it's moving now. Yeah, it's only the beginning of November, and you can see we've already got a little snow here in Michigan. So I can bring it down with this, and I also can bring it down with this. Now, <clears throat> this has an on-off switch right here. the on off and there's a switch here the battery is right here for it and it has an onboard charger right here so I have a switch here another thing you can do is we can make it free fall and you just release it here and just free fall I want it to come out quicker, like right now. It's got a big old heavy duty. And then I can turn it back and come right off of here. So if you want to get it out quick. Um, this is the same kind of system you'd have on the front of your truck or something like that. I'm going to grab a couple of the wireless. There's an also, there's a corded fob that goes in here. So we're like triple I'm never going to run out of a cord that works. I'll probably use the wireless key fob. Let's see, I have a corded one here, and then I have two wireless key fobs. So you'll never run out of juice on this. And this is this corded one hooks up here. We're gonna put that away. We're gonna go wireless. Wireless is cool. This is a 16 foot Superfly, an older model. The customer um, wasn't getting any younger and we get so much power anchors, systems, and all kinds of stuff in these, they end up getting heavy to get up a bad boat ramp like this, but um, this helps. This really helps that problem out. So I'm gonna actually take it off of this strap until it gets tight with that.
So I'm just letting this down off my wireless keypad. that we put inside the boat isn't this fast. It's sweet, but it's not this fast. It's the difference between, you know, 3,500 pound winch and this is, I think, a 9,000. So, bigger difference there. The knife in the boat, we'll, I'll kind of give it a little push over here. Being it's wireless, it's really handy. The tilt makes it really easy. And the boat's getting hot. 